All right, I just got a phone call that my friend Alana Lynn is in the hospital. Alana is a beautiful human being, incredible, great musician, and she's got some sort of weird stomach infection, bacteria or something like that. So I'm here to make her some balloon flowers and cheer her up, and at the same time show you how to make balloon flowers. If your friends are sick, it's a great way to make them feel better. What's the diagnosis? I have an infection in my abdomen and my liver. You don't even drink or smoke or anything. No, You're very but healthy. Something got some kind of bacteria is in my body. So you see these three balloons, these three skinny balloons. I'm going to show you how to make a flower right now with you. First thing you do is inflate two of these balloons to where you have about maybe four or five inches uninflated. I'm going to take these two and tie them together like this. Now I'm going to look at this and divide this into three sections. So there's a third right there. Now I'm going to take one of these and push it through. Now it's locked. Okay, so now I'm going to take it right here and make sure that it's the exact same size. So now I have four. four. And here comes the final petal. Now because this is all coming together, I could just twist it like that. But really I'm going to twist it together like this. Just save the step. So I wind up looking something like this. Now, because I want all of these to eventually come together, I take all six sections like this, almost like I'm about to bite a hamburger, like that, and I hold it and I squeeze it together, grab it with one hand, stick it, turn it around like that. So now I have six petals. Let me buy you a drink. Let's let the strong drink. You don't have to think I'll do the talking Now, I don't need this extra part here, so if I take it like this and just snap it, it comes off. Okay, so here we have the petals. Here's the third balloon. And I let the air out. You see what happens when I let the air out? You see how much longer it gets? So now I'm going to take it and wrap it around my fingers here. and make this curly. So now, you make a bubble at the end of the curly and simply stick it right here. There's the flower. Diamonds are hanging from strands of your hair Every 